Hi, my name is Melissa Ann Marie Farley. I am auditioning. Uh, this is awesome because I'm a camera whore and everybody always gives me a really hard time, but now I actually have a legitimate excuse. And this is kind of funny because uh, I, I'm a journalist. I work for the Republic and for azcentral.com, so I interview a lot of people actually on my cell phone because that's the new trendy thing to do, apparently. And uh, <laughs> I've never like flipped the camera and recorded myself this way, so this will be fun. Um, but let's see a little bit about myself. Most people, when they meet me, they're really surprised to see how short I am. I'm actually only 4'10". I'm not complaining about that. <laughs> um, it's, it's, uh, it's just kind of part of who I am. Um, and they say good things come in small packages, so hopefully I'm a testament of that. Um, but yeah, I'm, I'm a lot shorter than most people think that I'm going to be when they meet me. I grew up in Arizona my whole life. I'm a rare native here. My whole family is here, but uh, we're all Italians. Food loving, loud Italians. Um, I actually have, they call this the Capone nose, as in Al Capone. Yeah, it's uh, crooked, but, <laughs> um, but my dad has it, my grandma has it. It just is my nose. Um, Let's see, I've always been in the arts, in love with it my whole life, and I can't get away from it. I've tried a couple different times, it just keeps coming back. I went to ASU to, well, I started out uh, as an art history major because I love art, I always have, but then I realized that research is really boring and it's not at all like an Indiana Jones movie. So I switched majors and I majored in. Um, interdisciplinary media and performing arts and yes that is a mouthful and yes most people don't know what that is but it was a really awesome degree and uh, I actually got hired to work at the Republic like I said in AZ Central and that's what I do now and I act I'm an actor I act almost as much as I work so it's you know like an 80 hour week for me a lot of times but I love it so my strengths and weaknesses um strengths I I give myself to everything that I do, and I only do what I love, so um, it's it's full force for me all the time. I'm always on, I'm always going, but uh, it's it's amazing, and I, you know, I, I, I meet so many cool people, and I do so many cool things, and I'm just so appreciative of all of it, and I'm a big lover. I love everybody. <laughs> I have so many friends from all walks of life, from different backgrounds, from all over the world, and I just think it's so cool to see who they are and what they believe in and what they love and it's just a it's a it's a really incredible thing how diverse people are so and I'm a good listener I do like to talk and, and be in front of the camera but I'm I'm definitely a good listener which is good in acting because acting is all about listening and reacting so uh weaknesses I'm really sensitive I get my feelings hurt a lot um I mean I don't like walk around crying or anything but um you know, I just take everything pretty personally, and I'm a perfectionist, a little bit of a control freak. Um, I'm working on that, though. <laughs> um, so we'll we'll see. Um, oh, I want to apologize. I waited like all day to try to get the house quiet and empty, and then the yard guy shows up. So if you hear random leaf blower action, I'm so sorry, but that's what's happening outside. It's not the end of the world, I promise. Um, my pet peeves. I have really weird ones. Uh, I, I hate like the pruny fingers, the wrinkly fingers. I used to actually, believe it or not, wear like mittens when I <laughs> when I would get out of the shower. Uh, I don't do that anymore because I even think that's weird. But I still kind of want to sometimes. Um, I only drink milk out of a plastic cup. I don't like the way it tastes or smells out of glass. I don't know. I'm pretty easygoing. I don't have that many pet peeves, but like I said, the ones that I do are weird. Oh, and I am um, I'm OCD with hygiene. So, like everything I do with hygiene, like wash my face and my hair, I do everything three times. That's irritating and weird. Um, so I guess one of my pet peeves would be people that aren't clean. I don't know. Anyway, that's just a little bit about me. I hope that you enjoyed it, or at least were somewhat amused. And I thank you for the opportunity. Hopefully I'll hear back from you.